Hey guys, we're back on Justin's account and we are going to be now improving his arena defense. This is a defense that we're going to be making. He is blessed with Molly. Well, Molly's because he has three of them. We are going to be revamping his defense because he recently pulled Carnal, which is a very, very good arena lead. And he could finally run a tanky arena defense. His best score was C2 long time ago with a 10% or not even a 10% defense rate. So I'm hoping that this defense improvement will get him some wins and maybe he can even aim for a new score. Hey guys, before we start the video, if you guys are interested in getting advice and help from me and other Summoner's War players, feel free to join my Discord where the link is in the descriptions below. Also, if you enjoy my content and want to support me, become a Patreon, where the link for it is also in the descriptions. I want to say I appreciate all the support, and believe me, I really do. Anyways, that was it. Let's get back to the video. Just letting you guys know, we are actually done with his Leo team as well. I went with the Bale that's currently not scaled up. However, due to the fact that we have three fight sets in the Galleon uh, plus the Leo, we are still hitting 30 to 40k. Okay, so we're gonna first start with the Molly. Well, not this Molly, the other Molly that's inside. Um, because you see, this is level 36. He actually has other Mollies. And I personally like Mollies on Violent Nemesis. However, if you can't get the stats with the Nemesis set, I do go Violent Broken or Violent Endure. Mostly because I do like a faster Molly and I like to tune the entire team based on how fast the Molly is. I want Molly to go first. If a unit is stunned or sleep or anyways debuffed in some way, I would like the Molly to wake that unit up so that that unit could do what it's supposed to do. We are going to give this Molly a violent endure build with plus 25k HP and some defense. Okay, this is a new Molly, almost 40k HP with some defense, 100 resistance and pretty damn fast, 237 speed. I hope that this one will work a lot better than it was before. It's on Violent Endure with 14% recovery on skill three. Nothing crazy, but it was definitely better than what he had before, which was no recovery on skill three, which is kind of damn weird. Next, we'll actually work on the Carnal. So we know that Molly's 237, so we technically want the Carnal to go after the Molly since Molly has a single target strip. If she does proc, Luckily, she might get a lucky strip and then Karna could follow up to that strip. Violent Will mostly tanky. Currently, it's like this with missing runes. So this is the new Carnal on 229 speed, right? Yeah, 229 speed, uh, 53k HP. Really, really tanky, really, really fat. A little low on the defense though. And accuracy is pretty good. I hope that he does the job. With the 44% HP lead, this is a really, really tanky Carnal. Next is we're, we're going to work on the Triana. We're going to put her on 100 resistance, not a swift build, definitely a violent build. And Will, if you could get it, I think it's really important to get Will. However, if we can't get it tanky enough, I would go for a Nemesis or an Endure build. Okay, so this is Triana on violent Will. We were able to get a violent Will build. Actually, we weren't able to find a good build in violent Endure or violent Nemesis. So we have to use this build. Um, there's a lot of improvements that could be made. This rune was not powered up at all. So we could, if we want to, actually put this right here. Plus six, not that bad. We get it. Um, and then maybe even switch this for a defense gem. I'm not exactly sure. It's really up to you. A lot of runes that are not grinded. So this is definitely a unit that needs to be worked on where it needs better grinds and gems. Just have to let you know that a lot of fight runes were taken due to the fact that I made a second turn Leo team with fight sets, so you might have to rebuild your BGR5 team. Finally, we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna work on the Abelio. Abelio that's going to be on Violent Nemesis, Violent Will, Violent Endure. I'm gonna make it fast actually, a little fast, because if it's too slow, it's too easy for Chunk Punk to push back. Well, assuming that it does even get a pushback when you have 100 resistance, but there's a good chance that we might not get 100 resistance, so we have to try our best and work with the runes that this account has. Okay, so this is Abelio on Violent Broken. A lot of runes that need work. However, this is the best we could do. He does not have a lot of grinds or gems. So we'll just work it like this. Not a crit damage Abelio, just a Abelio with 100 resistance and with some accuracy so it could bring in some control. But overall, the team is done. The fastest is the Molly on Violent Endure, 100 resistance. The second is the Carnal. 
that's putting in the control and all the damages. Just notice it's not scaled up. So please work on that as well. Um, the Triana, Violent Will, 100 resistance, pretty slow and pretty squishy, but there are runes that need work, so work on that. And finally, the Abelio on Violent Broken, 100 resistance, but there are still a lot of runes that need work. There's nothing that we could do here right now. So we'll end this video by attacking some defenses with the offenses we have created. This one looks like a good one. I wonder how fast the Shina is in this level. Please keep in mind, we are in Fighter 3 still. And they still outspeed. Holy cow. But, oh, will this be okay? No, our Acme is not moving. Oh, we do a lot of damage. So definitely a very hard hitting. Ooh. Definitely just damage twins. Oh, oh. Oh my goodness, we're so lucky. Just kill that Martina. Oh, we take a turn. Nice, nice, clean. Oh, why does the Martina come back? Martina, go for. Oh, Martina does not move. Oh, we actually come back from that. It's because we didn't get stunned. Ooh, this one we could go into because we have resets. Cool. Reset. Got it. Defense break. Clean up. Oh. Feels so good. Okay, this one could go in with our Leo team that I created. Remember, the bail has no skill ups at all. Oh no! Oh, it derped. Nice. That's fine. Oh shoot, no! Are you gonna die? Whew! Okay, Bale with no skill ups does, or by L, sorry, does. 50k damage. That's the stuff. That's the stuff. So easy. So easy. Look at that damage. Love it. Love it, love it. Should be able to deal with this one, right? Who's on despair? Oh, crap. Our Veronica's on despair. Oh, wait, but we just have to reset. We just have to reset. This is why Veronica's so good. Reset. Thank you. See the reset so she doesn't take a turn? Oh my goodness. What a broken unit, guys. What a broken unit. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, guys, but that was it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If there's anything else that you guys you guys would like to see in Summoner's War, please put a comment below. Again, if you guys don't agree with the defense, let me know. This was the tankiest and fastest with 100 res we could get on this account. Really, everything else is up to him farming and getting better runes. But that was it, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye.